Orange County, much like California, is filled with immigrants, and now the county is creating a hub to help arriving refugees find housing, food, health care, and other services. Thanks again for joining us here on ABC7 to Hulu and wherever you stream. I'm David Ono. And I'm Ellen Leva. Orange County is taking steps to open a new Office of Immigrant and Refugee Affairs. Roughly a third of the county's population is made up of immigrants. And now with this news, we're Annabelle Munoz has more on the plans for this new office and the organizations helping inform the process. Some of the Orange County leaders behind the effort for an Office of Immigrant and Refugee Affairs were first immigrants. I stand here today, a former refugee, an immigrant, serving as the Chief of Staff for Vice Chairman Andrew Doe, who, like me, is also a former refugee from Vietnam. I arrived in Santana. This was the port of entry for my family in 1965. The county's Board of Supervisors unanimously voted in favor of a plan by Supervisor Doug Chafee to establish the office. They say it will be a hub for resources. When I heard that 5-0 to zero vote, um, it really, really struck me um, because it is entering into a new phase here in Orange County and in recognizing and providing that respect and dignity to the immigrant community in a way that is going to be laser focused on helping and supporting. The county says it will work with state and federal agencies as well as with community organizations. Among them, the Council on American Islamic Relations Los Angeles, CARE LA, and the Coalition for Humane Immigrant Rights of Los Angeles, CHIRLA. We plan on hiring a director for the office with the input of numerous community-based organizations who are already working with our immigrant and refugee community. Irina Sabianina is a Ukrainian refugee. I had a lot of doubts and fears, like, uh, mm, what will I do there? She says the community support and government aid made a difference. It helped us uh, um, to keep motivating, to do something more. The county says in 2021 it created a team of county offices to help resettlement agencies supporting Afghan refugees. The board is now awaiting an update from the county CEO office in six months. Annabelle Munoz, ABC7 Eyewitness News.